Welcome to the pregame show brought to you by Recruit Links. I'm Kyle Smith along with the head coach for Chicago House AC today, Shannon Seymour. A big matchup today for Chicago House. If they get three points, they would tie RWB Adria for first place in the Heartland Division and they would have the tiebreaker for first overall in Division One. You know what's on the line today? Draw doesn't help. You need the victory. Yeah, um, again, been not trying to harp on it too much this week as we build up for a match like this. But again, the boys, we, we talked about it at the beginning of the week. We know what we need to do. Nothing more needs to be said. We just need to go. And at the end of the day, it's another game. And, you know, to be able to play in what's essentially a championship game is always an honor. So boys are ready and you know they, we'll see where, the, where where things happen. Obviously a lot easier said than done. You want to get ahead, stay ahead. What's it going to take for that be, to become realistic today? Um, yeah, I think um, for starters we're, it's going to start in the back, right? Um, defensively, right? We have to do the work. We have to make sure that um, we're organized defensively and we make ourselves hard to break down, right? The last thing we can do is um, give up a goal today, um, especially early. So Again, just keeping the boys focused on the defensive piece first and then obviously um, letting the boys be free, right? These, these guys, they know how to score goals. We've seen it in games uh, where we've had multiple goals, right, and, and even in different halves. So it's just about making sure things fall <laughs> where they may. But, uh, again, putting the ball in the back of the net, keeping it out of our net. Final thoughts about the game today. When will we see those forwards cheat up if it's tied or if you're down by a goal late in the match? Yeah, I mean, again, it'll depend on what the game's given us. If if uh, we're generating good opportunities, you know, and just don't need to switch much, then it's just about trying to get that whatever players in, in good spots to start finishing. Um, <clears throat> outside of that, uh, probably maybe around the 70th or something, we'll see where, where we're standing. Um, but again, it's a 90-minute it's a game at the end of the day. Boys just need to remember that, and it doesn't have to happen in the first five. Right. It's not how you start, it's how you finish. Exactly. That's Sam Seymour, and the play-by-play -play broadcast is coming up next.